Hello, I'd like to meditate with you today. Today's meditation will be on feeling agitated. Today I'm feeling agitated and I just want to let go of that sensation and try to be present with my awareness. See, I'm itchy. Everything's itchy, everything's annoying, everything's yeah. And I just want to get out of the sensation, but in order to get out of it, I sort of need to dive more into it in a weird way, at least in meditation. So in order to do that, you bring your awareness to the present moment. And in the present moment, if you're feeling agitated, then it can kind of make that sensation larger. But when you are aware of it, then you know how to deal with it. <sighs> Rather than just allowing it to take over you. So I'm going to be a presence with the sensations of being agitated. And that's meditation. Being aware of whatever is going on in the present moment. And awareness is the knowingness, the thing in your mind that knows what you're doing, saying, thinking, or feeling at any given moment. See, I'm still agitated, still fidgety, but it's okay. So that's how I'm feeling right now. But I'll watch that sensation come and go, come and go, and just notice, yeah, how it manifests in my body. So I'm feeling... You know what, I'm feeling pain, unfortunately, right now. And I think it's manifesting in other areas of my body. Because it's overwhelming if I just look at it in the actual area that it's coming from, because that's my pelvis, which is where my endometriosis is, which is stressful because I know that I have endometriosis and it's a disability, chronic illness, and it's not fun to remind yourself that you have this disability. So I think it's causing ag agitation. And that's good to notice for me. And if getting, if looking at the agitation itself is too annoying or too frustrating, <laughs> which definitely might, it can be. Breathing can help. Just noticing your breath. Noticing if it's shallow, if it's deep. Notice if it changes when you notice it. Mine gets deeper suddenly as soon as I notice my breath. Which is interesting. Makes me notice if it's shallow, then I want to make it deep. So I'll just notice that. Notice anything that comes and goes in your awareness as you sit and breathe. Just notice your breath. Deepen it if you can. Don't worry too much about it, if you can't. Just allow it to be your breath. It's always there, whether we notice it or not. So it's a good anchor for the present moment, so that you can Rest a little bit. Rest your mind on something other than agitation or stressful thoughts or... See, as soon as I start thinking about that stuff, I get hey, agitated. <laughs> That's okay. <laughs> I'll just be present with that. As always, try to just be present and accept. Being present it's like shaking hands with the moment. You accept 
and respect it for what it is, which is existence, is in the present moment. That's where we are all the time. So shaking hands with the present moment, no matter what it looks like, no matter what it feels like, Just be present. I'm noticing the pain in my abdomen from my disability. And that's okay. I can notice that. You know what else is making me agitated? The pandemic. <laughs> Being stuck inside seeing only a very few people. I'll just notice that. That waterfall of emotion that comes up when I think about that. And just notice, be curious with the present moments. And if it's difficult, that's okay. Notice that. Accept that. Be present with that. The difficulty. What does that feel like to, for something to be difficult? Even though you know you can do something, you can do it. We can sit with our thoughts even though it is difficult. What makes it difficult? What well, makes it difficult to sit with the agitation versus sitting with joy? Just notice. It's okay if there is a difference. Just look at that. Maybe there are no words to describe it. The agitation versus the joy versus the compassion for yourself versus judgment for yourself they're all so intangible but they have such a physical effect on us you can be present with that And just notice any thoughts that come and go as you sit and are aware of your breath or your agitation or just being open to anything that comes and goes in your mind. Whatever you choose to meditate on, just be aware. If you like your breath, then sit with your breath. If you like just thinking about agitation itself, because you can learn from it, go right ahead. <laughs> I'm kind of doing that right now. It's For me, it starts from the my abdomen and kind of radiates out of that. So I'll notice that. It helps to contain it in a certain area at least so that I 
the radiating doesn't isn't so strong when I'm aware of it, which is interesting. I feel so much more calm. <laughs> I was feeling very agitated. And now that I just sat with it and just, you know, sitting with it gives yourself compassion. You're saying, I'm feeling agitated. I need to sit with this and understand it. And I think that's giving compassion to yourself. Giving yourself care. So congratulate yourself for sitting and caring for yourself because it's so important. And breathe again. Breath is such a good tool for when you need to, you know, if your shoulders feel like they're riding up and you're tensing and your back feels tense and everything feels like it's just holding on to something. Breathe. I know it's so simple, but honestly, if you notice your breath with your awareness, then it just can calm you right down. Especially if you slow your breath just a little bit, as much as you can, without passing out, of course. <laughs> Don't want to get lightheaded. But just notice your breath. And I hope you enjoyed this meditation. Come back for more. Have an awesome day. Bye.